Hey guys, so today I'm doing my hygiene routine. I'm gonna make this really quick, really short. First thing I want to talk about is shaving. So I use a men's twin, twin blade uh, razor and it comes with 25 in here. And it's, um, works really good. It gives you a really close and clean shave and I love this. And I got this from Lytle. Then I'll use a olive oil to shave with instead of creams like conditioners, nair, all that stuff. I don't use nair, I just use a um, oil, you know? So, yeah, and I'm gonna move on to our skin. I use Panoxyl, and I will do an in-depth routine of how and how I cleared up my skin and what I do to take care of my skin, you know? Um, then I'll brush my teeth with neem. It's organic. It has organic properties in it. It has baking soda, black seed, neem leaves, mint, and clove. So it looks like this. It's from a natural food store. A local natural food store that I got it from. I love it. It looks good. Or if not... Hello Toothpaste are good. They have fluoride and fluoride fee toothpaste. And this one is the charcoal fluoride toothpaste. Depends on you what you want to do with fluoride or fluoride free things. And for down there, we use Dr. Bonner's because it's natural. This is the light one. Do not get peppermint thinking you can use this down there. You cannot. You cannot don't do it don't recommend it okay i really don't recommend it but definitely get the baby unscented dr bronner it's good i don't use swimmer wash i don't use um dove unscented not okay. for me you know but do you whatever you works for you works for you for for in the shower miss peppermint Castile soap, Ooh, Dr. Bronner's again works good. Gives you a some alafia. I love this black soap right here. It has black soap, shea butter, and peppermint in it, so it works very good. Okay, um, and it was just like seven or six dollars. I'm also gonna do like a video on body washes and why I don't use stuff and stuff but that's for a separate video you know and then I'll use for moisture I'll use either baby Johnson's baby oil and I don't have the top sorry but this it looks brown I don't know why this never focuses it's brown Johnson's baby oil this is the Shane cocoa butter one it smells so good y'all I recommend that it lasts all day and it works good it keeps you moisturized i don't have to re-moisturize and if not body oil gel works good also and then if not that um coconut oil this is from dollar tree and it works good it was one dollar there's no excuse out here y'all no excuse go to all natural stuff you can even use like olive oil grapeseed oil stuff around your kitchen this smells sunflower this smells good it's sunflower seed oil it to be a natural oil like it could work if you couldn't get any baby oil you could honestly just use sunflower oil and you'll smell like a sunflower but you could put perfume and it'll be good but it moisturizes you good i tried it one day and it works really good because it has vitamin e oil in it so vitamin e not vitamin e oil but you know and there's also sunflower mega care oils that work good they're small bottles but they're more of like a perfumey type thing you can use it for your hair which is mostly for but i use on my skin sometimes because it smells good it's i'll use it for like the ends of my hair or my like hands neck something like that just for a good smelling fragrance you get what i'm saying but and then if I don't use those, which I usually use baby oil, but on certain occasions I'll use perfume chick. And it's a um 
a business that this lady runs and it smells so good honestly like it's my um the one i'm using is watermelon kiwi or something i think it's watermelon kiwi and it smells so refreshing it lasts all day go walk by somebody they're like oh you smell good girl I'm like yes i use perfume chick so check out perfumechick.com deodorant so we got smarty pits aluminum free deodorant which is in tropical paradise super strength bacon soda it works very very good i love it so much and tom's um 24 hour long lasting lavender um deodorant this also works great i prefer this because this is okay let's compare so this is more of powdery like a deodorant you know and this is more of liquidy like not liquidy but more of um I really don't know how to explain it but like oh like um those one of those deodorants that you wind up and like gel comes out that sort of consistency when you put it on your underarms but yeah so those two are good and there's the other one i use it's rose vanilla scented i don't know what the thing is called i'll show the picture right here right here so then after all that is done i think i included everything i didn't actually for that so then i use this i i don't know why i didn't incorporate this but i saw this out of the corner of my eye i have all this stuff sitting out and it's a lot going on <laughs> but okay. i use the listerine naturals um mouthwash i almost said toothpaste mouthwash guys and for our period we use wipes pampers wipes unscented i think sensitive perfume free pampers use unscented wipes or whatever wipes you like but other ones can i guess throw your ph balance off but any wipes are good and if not if you're at home i'll usually if i'm at home i say if you're at home if i'm at home i will usually just use um a washcloth you know wash up but if not if i'm out i'm gonna use this pampers the last thing is natural cuts and pads. I don't use always unless I have to. I try to get the most natural stuff. The most natural mm. stuff. I don't think that's a word. But you get what I'm saying. Um, this is by Vita. Natural cotton pads, no chemicals, no synthetics, and no dyes. It comes with 14 in it. It has wings. I don't like the ones that don't have wings because I don't want to like bleed over and just mess up everything. And it helps. So these are the ultra thin ones, which are very good. And I really recommend trying natural cotton pads because they, I before I even knew about the science behind the natural cotton pads, I was like, wow. Like these work good and then i don't know how it works honestly but they say like when you um use natural cotton pads because it doesn't have no chemicals or dyes or anything it doesn't um your pms cramps or whatever it doesn't hurt as bad so i was like yes that's so good so i recommend all this stuff you know i'll link all the stuff in the description if i can and yeah so Thank you so much for tuning in.